Welcome to the Visa Halftime Report. Visa, everywhere you want to be. Well, there is an update for drivers in D.C. Now they need to look out for green bike lanes in that area. Hey everyone, this is DC Sports Limited TA back at it again with a special Visa Halftime Report, the 4th of July edition to be exact. <laughs> Anyways, there are now green painted bike lanes which makes cycling safer by reminding car drivers to what to watch out for when bikers are driving across the bike lanes, which is a great benefit and it works, but it's not the main reason why so many bikers get excited over a little bit of color. I mean, the real reason why people love um, the green painted bike lanes is because the lane, it's, it's so much more simpler and they send the clearest possible message that roads are not the only for cars. Um, and despite a century of sharing roads and despite the fact that people walked and biked in streets long before cars came along, there's a strong mentality among entitled drivers um, are for cars. I mean, a, fifth, a five second Google search contains plenty of examples. And um, green painted bike lanes, I mean, accomplish what a white stripe next to the parking lane cannot. I mean, they, pro they proclaim loudly and clearly that the streets are not merely sewers for car traffic, but for but fully multi-model public spaces. And they and they send the message that drivers are welcome to use the road just like everyone else, but they must not expect to have, to have roads completed themselves. And um, these companion bike lanes are pub public relations features um, as much as they are safety features, and as least as far at least as far as cyclists are concerned. So drivers can now um, share the road and they can see where the bike lane actually is instead of of having the bike lane just being marked and not being painted green. So I don't that's pretty much to say for the visa at the report. It's not gonna be much to say. And um, yeah, why don't I show you the, the fireworks of DC for the first time on this channel. I know I've been to Columbia and Gettysburg many times before, but this time we're shaking things up. From the east floor of the of the T building at AARP, here's fireworks from a distance, and yes, there's no loud popping noise. It's very ambient. Enjoy, guys. And we'll see you guys back here for the second half. just displayed USA on them. USA. Just displayed that. How cool is that? That's the helicopter. Probably. There might be PBS up there. Maybe PBS. I don't know. 